What's up, YouTube fam? Brandon Weaver here once again, and that's right. Someone's gotten $2,000 collections off their report. Boom, easy, quick. No problem, no muscle, no fuss. Hit the subscribe button if you want to boost your score as well. All right, so we've got Afzal. Sorry if I mispronounced that. Afzal. Okay, he says, hello on the other side. You guys are helping me reach my goals. I still have seven debt collector letters ready to send out. Okay, the validation letters along with round two. I got three of them removed already, okay? Three of them removed already from the first round, over $2,000, thanks to you guys. And thank you, I appreciate you for writing in. Thank you so much for sharing your story. Now, the question is, okay? About to send the second letter round to the bureaus. Do I also send the debt collection, debt collector fails to validate letter into the bureaus as well? Also, do I write all seven of the collection accounts to that bureau, or do I space it out into multiple letters? Great question. Here's the letter. You can put them all, 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 on, 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 one letter, letter, letter. Put them all like, just like that. Boom, 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 okay? Now, do you send it in with your second round of supporting documentation? Yes, absolutely you can send this in as well, all right? So you're disputing those negative collections along with the charge us, along whatever else is on there, with your 609 letters at 609creditrepair.com. You can get that Beyond Committed package. You can get this letter in the Beyond Committed package. We've got the collection validation letters, or we can do it for you at theawesomelifegroup.com. Now, with this letter, I'm gonna break it down for you, okay? You put all your accounts on there, and he says, I'm writing to dispute the above reference accounts. I've disputed these accounts, and you, you have said they are accurate, but how is that possible? Under the laws of the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act, I actually contacted the collector, and they were not able to verify this debt was mined, okay? The FCRA, and it continues to go and continues to go. I'm gonna paraphrase this. The FCRA requires you to verify the validity of an item within 30 days, okay? If the validity cannot be verified, you are obligated by law to delete the item. It is very clear. The FCRA is very clear, okay? I would prefer not to litigate. I will use the courts to enforce my rights under the FCRA. I look forward to you deleting this item, okay? So we've got that letter for you. You can send it in. You can do exactly what this individual is doing. You can get $2,000 off, right? Debts off. There's other videos out there. People are getting 10,000 to lead, 12,000 to lead, okay? Everybody's different. Everybody has their own unique story, their own unique credit repair journey, all right? So everybody can get some stuff off right here. Hit that like button if this video is helping you out and make sure to hit that bell for notifications for when you get this, when this content comes out, when I go live, we're having great live streams. We're getting a lot of great people on there. We're going, it's a lot of fun. People are answering questions with me and asking questions and answering and all this good stuff, right? now. We had a false repossession. This is why it's so important. Maybe you're on this uh, right now, right? You're on this channel and you haven't looked at your credit report in a while. It happens, it absolutely happens. There's individuals who don't do it. People will bury their head in their sand. I did it for a long time. You wanna go ahead and pull it because you don't know if there's inaccurate information on there, right? So you might be sitting pretty, you're like, yeah, I got my house, I got my loan, I got my car, everything's good. But the moment you need to go apply for something, you haven't looked at your credit in a while, stuff like this can happen where an individual's car was totaled out, okay? And this was his, uh, Joe, Joe writes in, it was his daughter. No fault of her own, right? Car was totaled out and they said it was repossessed even though they paid it, got a paid in full letter and purchased another vehicle with that dealership. Now, you've probably heard of this story. I'm not sure if you recall, but this is what happens at the end of it. They sent in their letter. They literally gave it to the dealer. They said, look, they called the dealership. They said, hey, you've been reporting this as repossessed for three years now. They said, yeah, it was repossessed. I said, no, we have a paid in full letter. They were like, uh, we'll get back to you. They called back, they said, yes, it was a mistake. Oh my goodness, we're so sorry, we're gonna take care of that, we're gonna delete that, right? But this has been three years of messing with their financial situation, so he was like, you know, can I take him to court? It would be great if they paid off my daughter's car note, right? They made a big error, they put that on there, what are the damages, right? That's what a lawyer will tell you. I'm not a lawyer, I have no legal experience or advice for anyone, just educational information. But what is the damage? If there were some damages there, they say, yeah, because of that, our interest rate was X amount higher. We've had to pay this amount. Those would be your damages, right? Or she wasn't able to get whatever it is that she needed to do, business, uh, another, home and another car at home, whatever it is. Whatever those damages are, the courts are open to you. We have 
the documentation of all the violations in case law and the beyond committed package at 609creditpair.com, we can help find violations, leverage those violations, and potentially get items deleted at theawesomelifegroup.com. If this video helped you out, give a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. Until I see you in person, I will see you on the other side. Take care.